empty yards at Hakia Prison as major crime detectives investigate the death of Ashley James Brofo. Paramedics were called to the 40-year-old's cell just after eight this morning, but they couldn't revive him. Brofo was due to be sentenced next week for luring a nine-year-old girl away from a Doubleview Park in July last year before sexually assaulting her at his home. He pleaded guilty to two counts of indecently dealing with a child under 13 and one count of encouraging a child to engage in sexual acts. Brofo was raised in the same home as kidnapper Terence Kelly, who abducted four-year-old Cleo Smith from her parents' tent in Carnarvon and held her at his home for two weeks. The two men were raised as brothers. Kelly is due to be sentenced next month. In a statement, Ashley Brofo's lawyer, Clint Hampson, says his client had a difficult upbringing and was navigating life with a significant intellectual disability and other mental health conditions. WA police say a number of male prisoners are currently assisting detectives with their inquiries. Rebecca Trigger, ABC News.